Well, hello Swift devs and Swift casters. I am going to turn off my headphones here because it has a nasty delay that messes up my speech. Anyway, so I'm Cameron. Uh, for those of you who don't know me, uh, Swift devs and SwiftCast.tv have just partnered up uh, with me anyway. Uh, so I'm going to be kind of doing these free videos for those of you that aren't subscribed to SwiftCast.tv. Now one of these articles um, that is actually in the blog, I did not know this until now, um, was actually, okay, so you have this project, right? And there's a better example in the blog. The blog post is in the description below. But let's say you have a button on top of this image view. And the thing is, this happens to me all the time. You'll be layering stuff on top of each other, and then you go to click on the image view, but instead on the... Um, the attributes inspector you're getting all this other stuff that's to the button you can't get to the imagery you know you're trying to get to it and the only way you can do it is through the document inspector over here which if you know anything about Xcode the document inspector takes up a lot of room it's really quite unnecessary and with this trick right here is very simple I did not know this until recently you hide the document viewer you don't need that if you hit control shift and then click you have all this right here, all the layers on top of each other. You can see all of them. You have the view controller, the view, the image view, and the button. The button being the top layer, so therefore it's at the bottom and it works its way down. So I click on the image view and voila, I have all my image options right here. You can set a picture, whatever. Now the blog post, uh, if I load it here, here it is. Um, it shows the same thing. It's right here, SwiftCast.tv. Uh, it's right there. Very easy to use. Um, and it's going to save you time. It's going to save you real estate on your screen because every now and then you'll have like six or seven different views on a storyboard, and you got to get from one to another, and they're all really close together. But when this document inspector is taking up room, it's just not worth it. So, anyways, it's just a simple way: Control Shift Click. You have what you need. You have your options, and I mean, yeah. So that's about it. I'm Cameron for Swift Casts and for Swift devs.